is up everybody mr. slipcover bullet Blake here I have an unboxing today uh, this is cauldrons newest wave wave 5 from cauldron it showed up today so here we go I'm so cautious about opening these okay And, oh, look at that, I got a magnet. I think that came with the bundle, so. These are the two newest releases from Cauldron. Liza the Fox Fairy and Seder, which I am actually really hoping it's as good as I'm expecting it to be. Neither I haven't seen either of these movies, so Seder definitely looks more promising out of the two. Uh, I know I was going to try and get my reviews up for the last wave, but I didn't get a chance to do that, so you can still expect the reviews from those. I will definitely be doing them, and yeah, I'm going to open these up, so... There's just been so many movies, and this is like the sale month where we have all the Vinegar Syndrome titles come in, all the Severn titles are on, well, they're not shipped yet, but they'll be on their way shortly, so it's just a matter of making the time. But that is Liza the Fox Fairy. That, I mean, it's really cool. It's got some embossing down here, the embossing on the title with the map. Oh, it's got, that's cool with the gloss chalk, chalk outline. Uh-oh. Okay, and it came with, looks like it's a poster. Yeah, it's just a poster of the cover art, apparently. Oh. Okay, I don't know how well you can see that. That's, I mean, that's neat, I guess. It's not something I would hang up. I don't really actually hang up a lot of these unless I have more than one. How is this folded? Like that? Because I like to keep them complete. But, this isn't really a poster I would hang up anyway. I'm, I'm not, like, super enthusiastic about the con like this movie. So, I mean, hope I hope it's good. But again, it's, a, it's another newer movie. I think it came out... 2015, so... You never know. Sometimes the newer ones are... I mean, like, Seder's not old either, but... This one, I just... I, I never would have bought this movie if it wasn't a Cauldron release, because... I love Cauldron, so. But the bigger movie for me is definitely Seder. That's. I mean, it's really cool artwork with the hands right there, the eyes on the back. Can you see that on there? Yeah, oh yeah. This is definitely the one from this wave that I. I'm looking forward to watching. I mean, I'm not... Yeah, so... I think this one is even newer, actually. 2019, so... But, this one looks cool. It's got a poster as well. It's just the cover art and... the back cover art, so... Pretty minimal compared to like some of their earlier releases, but you know, it's still cool to have the extras in there like that. Not a whole lot of special features on this, I can tell already, so I don't know. Like, I, I've been anticipating this one for sure, but you never know with the other ones. Like, these blind buys, most actually, I think all of Cauldron's films besides one have been blind buys for me. 
maybe two. I don't remember exactly every release they had, you know, they all blend together after a while, but yeah, so that is Cauldron number nine and Cauldron number ten. But that is all I have for today. So if you like what you see, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe. And until next time, have a good day.